Good morning, good morning, good morning. Hello. Welcome to Behind the Scenes, the number one channel for exploring in Angus. Indeed. Apart from Jack's channel, obviously. Indeed, we did want to And today, we're once again staying local, because Jack's driving. And um, we're heading down to Ochmithy. And we'll see if we get chased out of Ochmithy today. Is it not your turn to be driving anyway today? We took my car last time up to the, um, the, the old road, didn't we? Yes, we no, did. I drove up there. Excuse me, bro. Oh, no, no, yes, here you did. I drove to the train and the, the abandoned train bit, yes. Well, that was months ago. Last week, now you know we take it in turn, so this is not, I'm out, of, we're out of sync, but never mind, like, carry on with your. Well, you, that, you just said, well, I'll pick you up in 1029. Mm -hmm. So I just thought, fine. Right. We'll go back and take my car then. Right, come then, off to stop. So we've got the Spiz sticker on the car today. So it's lovely and still today, folks. The tide is out. Jack has checked the tide times on tidetimes.org. It's not quite pennant, is it, folks? So much better, because I'm here. So this is the path we're going along. We've been along this many times before, obviously. And we've got the mic on today, because it's a bit windy, as you might see on the old grassy stuff. <laughs> See, I'm not the only one that cycles along here. Other people cycle along here too. Here, the GoPro in his uh, helmet. There's a cave there, folks, which we're going to see if we can get to. We've never been down that one before, so let's see if there's a way down. So we're near there, folks. We've been walking for four and a half hours. And we're nearly there. We left at 10 this morning, it's now 2 o'clock. No, it's not really. It's only about a 20 minute walk, folks, from where we parked the car. But it's very hogweedy today, as you see, look. It's full of the poisoned, the poisoned weeds. Very overgrown here today. It's not normally this bad. But we're nearly there. We're nearly there. Right, we're in folks, so as you see, you have to follow this dedicated path, don't trample on the crops. There we are. So, will we manage to get down to the pot today? Probably not, but we'll go and have a look. This is where we are in the middle of this big field. So we've picked the wrong day to come folks, it's just too overgrown. As you can see, you just can't really see anything at all because of the overgrownness. Never mind. We'll try and get to it from the other side that we saw a minute ago. This jungle is big extension. Trying to get a bit of footage. The jungle's a bit close to the edge there. So I think it's the microphone, it's a problem folks, actual, the Hoover mic's not working properly, so this video, a lot of this video could be silent, what a disaster! Oh well, never mind, at least we know for next time. Yes, I think so. It sounds windy and I need my mic now. Next here comes Jag. 
Will he fall, fall, fall? No, we don't wish that on him today. It's quite steep. Right, folks, we've made it down to the edge of the, the rocky bit here. Now, just gotta be careful, there's lots of seagulls here with young ones, so we might get dive bombed. Entrance to the Gaelic pot is just over there, folks. I don't think we can get down. This jag. When the sun comes out, you can see how blue this actually is. So we're down on the other side now. It's a bit uh, seaweedy down here though, somewhere to watch. It's a bit, a bit slippy. Let's just uh, see how far we can get along here. Oh, I don't think it's another gap. We can't get across. Oh, slippy. Yeah, just watch what's quite slippy in bits. Yeah, just down the, that bit slippy. Yeah, it's definitely going to be a no-go, folks. We just can't get across. We've tried various bits to get across, and we just can't seem to to get over. It's just too dangerous. Never mind. Right, folks. This is as far as I said we're going to get. I caught to the top bit of the cliff. And there's the cave that we're trying to get to, but we just can't get there. There's too many ravines and drops and things, so... It's another fail. Been an enjoyable fail though. It's good down here. There must be another seagull island. They're all perched on there, waiting to dive bomb us. As you can see, it's another very steep climb, folks. This is it from my angle. The severity of steepness. We stop for another rest, folks, on the edge. Perched on the edge of oblivion. So that was our day, folks. Thank you very much for watching. And tune in again soon. And check out the highlights of my week coming up on another video after this one. A bit of snooze fest. Snooze fest, obviously. Thanks for watching. Ciao. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Right, folks, we're back. We're what? back. What? <laughs> we're not gone yet. Got a change of plan and we're going for a scone in the Lunan Bay Diner. I'm so excited. Don't man. think Jags have had a scone from there, so no. and it's a Sunday, so I might be busy, we don't know. Hopefully so not. we'll film the uh yeah, the scone the score. occasion. Yes, we'll film the occasion. Jack goes to Lunan for a scone. Two packs of butter, that's a good start, I must say. And a wee pot of jam, yes, most. When you take them out a bit warm, so that's up to you. Mm. Mind? So, yes, as you've seen on Jag's channel, a poor 6 out of 10 today, folks. It was quite busy. The scones, wasn't much choice for scone. I had to make do with a cherry scone today. Um, and yeah, just a bit busy. But we've got a table. Mm -hmm. So actually, I might give an extra half mark because I've got an outside table on a busy day. 
six and a half out of 10 from me and a six from Jag. So which makes 12 and a half out of 20. So very average today, folks. Anyway, that's it now. Bye-bye.